Welcome to the Nicholas Eleven Expo of Technology. Today we're looking at the Gigabyte F2 A88XM DS2 motherboard. This is an FM2 Plus socket board with the flagship AMD A88X chipset for the coming Kaberi APUs. In the box is the motherboard itself, the I.O. shield, two SATA cables and the manuals with the driver CD. But I'd recommend downloading the latest drivers from the Gigabyte website. First of all, I want to say this motherboard looks really good for a price with the black and grey color theme. The PCB isn't black, but it's dark brown. This is a micro ATX motherboard and the flagship AMD A88X chipset is used here and it's cooled down by this little heatsink here. On this board, we have a 4 plus 1 power phase design as you can see and the AMD FM2 Plus socket is used for the new Kaveri APUs. And the FM2 Plus socket is also backwards compatible with the FM2 processors such as Richland and Trinity. Right here we have two DDR3 DIMMs that support the dual channel technology. And as for the frequencies, DDR3, 1333, 1600, 1866, 2133, as well as 2400 MHz at OC is supported. As for the expansion slots, we have a PCIe 3.0 x16 slot right here, but to use PCIe 3.0, you will need an FM2 Plus APU. Then right here, we have a PCIe 2.0 x1 slot, as well as a legacy PCI slot. On this board, we have a total of four SATA 6 gigabit per second connectors that run of the AMD A88X chipset. As for the headers, here's an USB 3.0 header, the front panel headers, the two USB 2.0 headers, the COM header or also known as serial port, the SPDIF out header and the front panel HD audio header. On this board we have two fan headers, the CPU fan header right here and the system fan header. As for the power connectors, here we have the ATX24 pin power connector and up here the ATX12 volt 8 pin power connector. As for the onboard audio, we have the Realtek ALC887 audio codec. This board comes with an UEFI BIOS and also features the dual BIOS feature. On to the back panel then. Here we have two USB 2.0 ports, one PS2 comma port, one VGA and DVI port. Here we have two USB 2.0 Pro ports, one gigabit LAN and two USB 3.0 Pro ports and last but not least the HD audio jacks. So yeah, this Gigabyte GA F2 A88XM DS2 motherboard definitely is not a bad board at all. It offers a lot for the price and also looks good and therefore has a great price performance ratio. In my opinion this is the board to go for if you're in a very tight budget. Pros are great price performance ratio, despite the low price, good looking. I have nothing to say for the cons. I definitely recommend this Gigabyte GA F2A88XM DS2 motherboard. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.